All right, you, you know how it be. We're back on tower. I just kind of hopped in the arcade. I saw 279 is the score to beat for this weekly, like, stack'em. And I have not got on the stack'em leaderboards in, like, in two months, you know? Like, I'm a recovering, like, stack-aholic. But, you know, I'll dip in, like, once, you know, once and, once or twice, like, here and there. Words are very hard. And I kind of figured, you know, 279, that's totally doable. Let's see if we can just one-shot that. And then we will go on our way and see what's up in the Towerverse today. Oh, we're doing really good too. Oh well. This should be a good run. This should be like 300 something, 400 something. Not bad. Oh man, I just missed it. Hey, I got a gold coin though. I really wanted to. Uh... Uh, should I give it? One? I'm gonna give it one more go, and then we'll kind of see what's going on in tower. I'm not gonna waste too much time playing stack them. Like I said, I'm recovering. We're fully recovered. But every now and then, like you gotta like dip into the pressing the space bar. It is a very important thing to uh, to do. Oh, this is feeling pretty on point. The pumpkin Blast is going. Do I want to do Pumpkin Blast? I don't know. Maybe. Maybe I will. After stack him, I'll hop out and try it. But not until I'm done with stack him. This should be good. Yeah, we're good. At least I'm on the scoreboard for like 20 minutes. There we go. Well, that at least gets me on it. Yeah, yeah. I'll enjoy that for now. But yeah, good morning. Sorry, I just wanted to record stack and the pumpkin blast happened and whatnot. But yeah, not much new with me. It was uh, my birthday on Halloween. That is, that is my day of birth. I basically streamed that day. I went to uh, the casino the day before. Like, not the tower one, but a real one. I lost a ton of money. Played the Jurassic Park 3 slot machine and, like, this one called, like, Dragon Link that was really fun. And I played a bunch of them. But, uh, yeah, they, they all took my money. It's kind of like what I expected. That is how I spent my last few days. Uh, watched some movies with my Twitch team. We watched uh, Halloween 4 and Nightmare on Elm Street. And I overall just kind of sort of just chilled out. I'm not going to lie, though. I'm kind of recording today with a bit of a very upset stomach. I uh, streamed today, and I woke up with a bad stomach ache. I, uh, I made some uh, ramen yesterday, and I used a little bit too much of my hot sauce in it. Or, like, chili sauce or whatever. Uh, so that definitely threw me off. And then I had some veggie burgers after stream. Thinking, hey, veggie burgers are pretty light. That'll be fine. Mm -mm. My stomach is definitely hurting me at the moment. It did not like me doing the veggie burgers. <laughs> but it is what it is. I'll have some soup later. That's the, uh, that's the excitement of my life. Just nothing crazy. Very mundane, as always. I've just been really enjoying a lot of the stuff I've been streaming. I've been way more into making stuff than I have been lately. I feel like I'm kind of like on like a, a, good, a good streak right now. Like a good record. I'm having... I'm actually having like a really good time. Then I realized I kind of neglected making my uh, my vidges again. So here we are. I still have like big like edited projects I want to do that I've been saying I want to do for like a year and a half, two years. Like maybe I'll finally do it, but who knows? Probably won't. I know me. I'll say I'm going to do it. I'll start it, and then it just will never get done. But at least as I say this, I can pretend I'll get it done. You know. Ooh. You know what I noticed, though? Um, there's really, like, a dis- Thank you, Ghoul Coin. There really is, like, a distinct lack of, like, trick-or-treat happening in these, uh, these lobbies. This year. I have not been seeing it happen too much. Which makes me quite the sad person. Because I used to just, like, going around collecting all the trick-or-treat barrels. I've only seen it a few times. Th uh, same thing with Haunted Remains. Which is a shame. What's the uh, what's the jackpot? Eighty-five, nine, eighty. 
It's not gonna go, but let's, let's do a few spins of this. See if I have better tower slot luck than real slot luck. Let's do five spins. Ooh! Maybe we'll actually have good luck this time. Oh! No. Pain. Okay, spin three. I think this is spin three. Spin four. Spin five. No luck. I spent more than I made, but that's okay. Let's do a double or nothing. Why not? I'm gonna take my luck while I can get it. <laughs> and that's how you beat gambling addiction. You just you just take what you can get. Uh, that and also just want to get the Halloween character visit in the next 20 seconds. And you don't want to be stuck in a casino. So you just kind of you leave the machine and say you got a 3x. It's good enough. That's how you do it. Uh, then after I do this Halloween character visit, I think, I think I'm going to see if any new condos were uploaded. I don't know if they have or not. I haven't really checked. I kind of hopped in Plaza to do a ghoul coin check, and I'm very low on them, still. I've really done a terrible job at, uh... Farming up this event. Like, an awful job. But too many games I play do Halloween events, and Tower is by and far the grindiest event. Like, significantly so, and this is coming from a Dead by Daylight player. Dead by Daylight's like, it took a while, but I got it done. Towers? I have yet to buy a single item out of the ghoul roaster yet. It is brutal. There you are. I got, like, a Super Animal Rails event done. I did all of Fall Guys. This game, though, I'm, I've barely made any progress, and I've done a few hours. Like, I've just got nothing done. Which is a shame. Uh, What do we got that's new in here? Howling Mattis 8, Trick or Treat, Work in Progress, Weezer... Beachfront nightclub. Okay, let's see. Let's download the nightclub with the rooftop bar. Let's check that out. Theater for full length movie streaming? Uh, that's a big one, but we'll check it out and make sure, you know, our game doesn't crash. We got one just based on Weezer. Bliss City, sure. Trick or Treat Work in Progress. And Howling Mad Estate. Alright, I gotta get Task Manager up because I feel like any of these could crash my game. So, I'm very worried about that, but let's see. Let's check them all out. Alright, let's just go on Weezer first because I feel like this is just gonna be Weezer pictures in an uh, empty condo. So, let's just, let's just verify that. You know? I knew exactly what to expect, and yet I am both thoroughly entertained and thoroughly disappointed. Do you think the outside's painted with Weezer? You didn't paint the outside with Weezer? Oh, I'm disappointed. Well, well worth the time downloading that. Alright. So that's a, that's a note of Weezer. Uh, theater for full-length movie streaming. Let's just see what this theater looks like. Maybe it'd be cool, maybe it won't. Alright. Films will start from beginning upon entry. Enter together to sync play with friends. Leave via door to reset the film. Death will allow the film to continue while being in lobby. Volume can only be adjusted outside of Tower Unite. Do not skip, skip film specific theaters. Do not spoil endings. Wait, do they actually have like legitimate movies in here? Really? There's no way. I was gonna say, there's no way they just have, like, this working, right? Theater 5. This looks really cool. Yeah, 
was gonna say, there's, there's no way. But they were like, mentioning like all the different sync stuff you could do. So wait, what's what's going on in this one? Hold. So let's start from the beginning upon entry. Enter together to sync play with friends. Leaving via the door will reset the film. I'm very confused. Incredibly so. Well, Shaun of the Dead. Squid Game. That's locked. Kung Pao, enter the fist. Free guy. Okay, so we go in Kung Pao, enter the fist. Yeah, I don't like what they're trying to do here. It's a nice looking movie theater, though. I'll give it that. Like, it's a nice looking one, but I don't really foresee movies playing. I was like, I don't know how that would work. Unless I'm missing something. Uh... Let's go and trick-or-treat next. Trick-or-treat looks like it's going to be kind of like a small thing, and then we'll go into the two bigger condos. I know I'm covering, like, the Halloween condos after Halloween, but you know what? It'll be Halloween every day. It's fine. But I assume this is going to be a very, like, smallish thing. Hi. But I guess we'll see. I'll be the judge. Hmm. Ah, uh, hello. Nothing too crazy so far. Nothing in there. Anything in the closet? Empty closet. Yeah, you know, I don't know if I'd really put a TV like that, but you know what, whatever. You don't, you do you. What's in the basement? Oh, okay. Dude, the, the starry, like, walls always trip me out. Okay. It's a little framework. They're getting, they're, they're getting it started. I'll give it a little thumbs up. Why not? I'll support it. Just a little something something. Alright, let's go to Bliss City next. It says it's a collaborative design. And a condo like this, I usually get worried that it's going to crash my game. So, we'll see. So far, things are looking fine, though. Kind of. Um... No, it's not. Is it fine? Wait... Are we memory leaked? Are we memory leaked? Hold. Maybe. We're not memory leaked. Almost memory leaked. But not quite. That was like really close to being bad. <laughs> My game almost crashed. And I used like 14 gigs of RAM, but now we're down to 8. No subway. Disgusting. How can I help you today? This building is 15 stories tall. Can you believe that? This is the teleport room. Okay. Ah, so we got like a bunch of like little places we can teleport to. We got some credits. Animal Crossing dudes. A bathroom. Gordon Ramsay. Let's get cooking. This lamp's want to cook. It's following Mary to school. It's a good fucking thing that cats love raw fish because the salmon steak is looking like fucking sushi. What are you, an idiot sandwich? Beautiful. Let's see ya here. Hmm, that's a yummy food. Okay. Disembodied head of Mario. I'll take it. These are the kind of condos I live for, you know? Alright, so I used the elevator. Oh, wow. So they actually do have, um, all the floors mapped out, it looks like. So what's campsite like? Campsite is indeed a campsite. Oh, okay, so we got some Dead by Daylight going. Got Megan Ash out here. Legion. God damn it, somebody joined this lobby already. Well, you already got two people. 
but I do like the uh, the DVD aesthetic. If you want to play DVD, you usually have the killer in the background looking over the lobby of survivors joining in. This isn't the campfire I'm used to. What is this place? See, if, if it was Ash from DVD, you'd say, look who's shitting in the tall grass. Do we get, like, Bill or, like, Nia or anyone hiding around or no? Doesn't look like it. That's good. I, I enjoy that. That that has more work put into it than the DVD lobby for the Halloween event. Drive-in. Ooh, we get, like, some SpongeBob-looking restrooms. I still have yet to play Undertale all the way through. It's just a little drive-in theater. Okay. Little TARDIS up there. We got the Krabby Mobile. We got the Flintstones here. That one car that everyone drove in Vice City. Sport car. Um, Superman station wagon. All the essentials. Oh, and there's the major tower back there. Okay. And this is Mount Overlook. Mount Overlook is, um, uh, is Mount Overlook from Firewatch? Is that what they're trying to go for now? Maybe. It sounds somewhat familiar. Still got more to check out. So we got Church of Something. Pride, greed, wrath, envy, lust, gluttony, sloth. Because of these sins, the anger of Moby is coming. That was indeed a thing that I have done. How do I leave this church now? Ah, I see. Oh, I don't see. Oh. And I fell off the edge of the earth. <laughs> okay. Uh, it's just kind of warning you about stuff. And they say floors 10 and 13 have things. Okay. So I'll check 10 and 13 after I check out Goat Tower. What do we got with Goat Tower? Or is it just kind of... It looks kind of empty. Yeah, this looks completely empty. I'm just going to fly up. It is. Alright, so floor 10 and 13, and there's another portal to go straight to Spooky. Alright, let's see what we got. Eight, nine, ten. Oh, yeah, can you see if any of them have anything? Ah, Arcade and Casino. We'll go to floor nine first. Horse Plinko, beautiful. I love Horse Plinko. Got some Polybius here. I don't know how you'll play TF2 on that, but you know what? You do you. We got the Mario 64 DS Luigi. We can take the stairs we want, but I don't want to take no stairs. Club Fuchsia. Alright, so just a little generic nightclub thing. Mo, what's up? Hey, welcome to my little corner of the bar. Picks up phone, Mo's Mo speaking. Who? Yeah, hold on. Mike Crotch? Does anyone see Mike Crotch lately? Perfect. If they didn't have, like, a, uh, a Bart Simpson prank call in there, I was going to be very upset. So I'm glad they did. Haunted House Floor 13. What do we got? Death Reaper of Souls. Hi. Ah, I see. Looks like they put some work in this one. Cool, dude. What's in this vault? Whatever's in this vault's probably gonna be no good. Let's see. A 
hello. Why are you Blair Witching? I could go deeper in here, but I'm not going to. You got like a little platform challenge? What is this? That kicks you out. Okay. I don't want to know. What do we got? Cam Irving, Hopes and Dreams. Is it Squid? It's Squidward's Hopes and Dreams. Beautiful. Old Man Monty. Okay. I can deal with that. I'm cool with that. Get some SCP stuff. Nice little tribute to Five Nights there. Nice. I actually like this haunted house a lot. It's pretty nice. I'm probably missing a ton of rooms. You know, what can you do? This place looks pretty freaking big. Let me go back through here. I am so lost. Nothing to this. That's just, that's literally a nothing. And now we're back here. Okay. Thanks for looking. If you enjoy, please vote in the Pixel Tail Halloween contest. You know, I didn't hate it. I'll give the, I'll make that my review. I did not hate it. Alright, so now before I exit out of this condo. What's straight to spooky? Oh, this is going that's just a teleporter right to the haunted house. Okay. Yeah, that was pretty good. I liked that. Now let's check out the one other thing here. Which is Howling Mad Estate. It's a hundred megs. So I feel like this could really crash my game depending on the amount of items. 15,794 items. I don't know if I feel good about this. Uh, we'll see. We will see. It's a lot of items. I don't see any way this game's not going to crash, but you never know. Because uh, that's a lot of items. And that veggie burger is killing my stomach. But I repeat, that is a lot of items. But I already loaded them all. Nice. Work in progress, few things, still need some work. Okay. That's fair, there's 15,000 items there. You were here. Oh, wow. Is this, like, is that, like, an actual, like, accurate map? I guess we're gonna find out. Howling Estate. Fortune Telling. What do we got? Welcome. Come sit. Discover what your future holds. Everywhere you go, I'll be watching you. Jimmy Hoffa is now buried in your backyard. Beautiful. Do my frame rate right now? You can probably barely see it in the YouTube video, but like it's in the 20s on this condo. That's rough. Alright, so it doesn't look like they um decorated every room. Looks like they decorated some. But definitely not all. And so far, this isn't super over the top. Usually when I get, like, condos like this, I expect, like, over the top to happen. That is not what I'm being provided, so I actually kind of enjoy that. I'm sure there'll be some memory happening somewhere. Just not yet, though. 
And I kind of appreciate that. Alright. So I got a huge base of stuff to work off of here. Oh, hello. It appears I've run out of silk. Would you mind collecting some for me? There should be plenty in the forest. Just watch out for spiders. Yeah, no, I'm good. It's pretty nicely designed. Like, we got little, little cat pictures. Anything else in there? Yeah, so this is just genuinely like a nice, like nice little house. It's just a shame about the performance that I'm getting right now. Like I know on video it looks very laggy. Not much I can do about that. This game is like actually maxing out my system right now. Uh, just exploring it. It's pretty rough. I'll be out of this very soon. So uh. For now he's gonna deal with the laggy video. Alright, let's just go check, like, the outer area really quick, and then I will probably leave this, even if I don't see it all. Just for the sake of my PC's, like, health. Because it does not like this. But it is pretty expansive. And I do appreciate the expansiveness. That I do like. Alright. So what is down here? Oh, I like the eye on that. That's kind of nifty. Is there like a little cave? Can I go in this? I cannot. Your rigor mortis. Nice guy. Alright, though. I, I do like this. It's nice. But for the sake of my own PC, I gotta disconnect from it. Because my everything hurts on my PC right now, but I like that. Alright. I know we've already been going for like 30 minutes, but I wanna see if I can, like, is there a virus lobby going now? And I'll play an Accelerate. They're already almost done with the Accelerate. Uh, let me just do like one race on my own. Let me just do a quick Pine Valley. I've not done that on video in a while. Let's just do that. Before I call it. Those are some cool condos though. I, I think Weezer's are going to be an all-time classic. Ready, set, go! Absolute classic. Alright. And after this, I'm gonna go ahead and lay down. Uh, for the sake of my own stomach. I'm at the age now where even veggie burgers are a mistake. That's okay. I feel pretty on point here, though. And I do like feeling pretty on point. Hell yeah, dude. Not my best turns, but at the same time, I feel like this is pretty acceptable. All things, like, all things considered. Perfect. Excellent. Missed the items, not good. This. Cool. 
Global rank 145, I'll take that. That felt like a really smooth go, too. I went off course a lot, but like, it didn't feel bad. Ready, set, go! Alright, I always do way worse on course 2 on this one, though. I'm very bad at course 2. Maybe, just maybe, I can make some magic happen. Maybe. Didn't make that. I never, like, know, like, why I missed that. Like, I don't know if I'm supposed to jump at the end of it, or if I'm just, like, supposed to let it take me. But sometimes I make it, other times I don't. I used to, like, know why, but, like, now every time I play on Pine Valley, I feel like I always just kind of screw it up. Which is what it is. Okay. Turn this nice and clean. Beautiful. So you just jump. Okay, I got more air, uh, air there than I feel like I ever have. Huh. Did they change, like, the physics of, like, Accelerate at all? Because, like, stuff just feels, like, way more on point right now. I don't know if they changed anything since I last played. I should read patch notes, but, like, things feel, like, a lot more smooth. Like, dramatically, like, smoother. Or drastically smoother. Whatever the proper word is. One more lap after this, but this should be a guaranteed gold coin. Because uh, this race alone is like three minutes, so I should be getting my nice coin. Should. That felt fairly clean, not great, but clean. Perfect. Excellent. Give me my gold coin, please. Let me wrap up in style. That's what I thought. Making sure I got my XP. But I guess we're gonna call it there. I just like wanted to chill out, let my stomach do its thing, get a few ghoul coins, check out some condos. I feel like I accomplished that. I just wanted to ramble and hang out, so I, I feel like I feel like we did good. But yeah, I'll catch you guys again in the next tower video where I'll probably be trying to get some more uh, ghoul coins before this is done. Cause I got till November 16th, so I got two more weeks to collect these coins. So hopefully I can get something out of this. Uh, but yeah, y'all have a lovely day, and as always, toodles, y'all.